Hey, beautiful people. NVIDIA recently released RTX Voice. It's, uh, it's an application that does real-time noise cancellation that sort of, kind of requires a video card with RTX and, more confusingly, a video card. I say confusingly since this is not a computationally intensive task. Not even a little bit. I've been using an open source tool, that's an LV2 plugin called Noise Repellent, here in this studio for years to accomplish the same thing. And unlike RTX Voice, it's cross-platform, it works with any video card, and I mean, it even works on a Raspberry Pi. So I thought, I thought it'd be fun if we took the Pepsi challenge and just see how it fares against Fanny McFan face, uh, since that's apparently how the kids are testing um, the new RTX voice on YouTube. Neat. So let's get on with it. What do we have? Uh, this this is our audio setup. This is a door. It's running on Debian 10, and we are using, as you can see, that in your left-hand corner is noise repellent running in a channel strip, and my channel strip is composed of noise repellent, calf gate, LSP, it's a mono compressor, and calf de -esser. Simple enough. So what I'm going to do is we're going to take off all the channel effects, and I'm probably going to have to crank the gain up quite a bit to introduce the noise that I don't necessarily have. That's not a humble brag, it's just decent audio engineering. And we're going to crank the fan on and see how it fares. Maybe it'll be good. Maybe it won't. Leave your opinion in the comments, and I'm sure you will. So let's get started with this. Uh, I'm going to pull off noise repellent. The gate. No more compressor. And calf de -esser. Oh no. You now know what I truly sound like. The horror. Not really. We're going to need to cut this up quite a bit. So I am increasing the gain with trim. Let me back off this. Okay, we're getting just a little bit of hiss in there. All right. Let's prepare your ears for Fanny McFanface. Let's cut it on low. It's a little bit. We can, we, we can go higher. I think that's a, that qualifies as background noise, right? It does. So what we have to do, to be fair, since I know there's no real settings on the RTX app, this is noise repellent, out of the box, default settings. What we're going to do, one advantage this has is you can learn a noise profile and apply it per strip because we run four instances of this during a show. Let's reset the noise profile. And we are going to learn it. I'm going to give it five seconds. I think that's fair. So. Now the moment of truth. Let's uh, enable. There we go. That's how that works. Uh, that's not too bad. Honestly, I just set up this shot to test this. So I haven't really had much practice with this. Uh, typically, we use it just to take out just any background hiss or rumble because not everybody on the show has, you know, a big honking preamp or a big honking interface. Um, that That's working better than I thought it would. This is available for Linux, Mac OS, and Windows as a plugin. I have no idea how you would do that. And you could use Adore. Adore is available on all three platforms. But I think it's just too easy to do that. Let's blow the fan directly into the microphone and see how it handles that. You might want to cut your volume down because I'm doing no processing, post processing on this audio after the fact. So let's cut off. And we're going to get this fan right into the microphone. Worst case scenario, that'd be wind noise. Ooh. Okay, we'll give it five seconds. I 
just gave it five seconds to reset a noise profile. Take two. There we go. I did it correct that time. Sorry, I'm not going to be able to edit that because any edits I do, I'm like, oh, you've changed this even though this is clearly something I could do and try at home myself, but I'll accuse you of tomfoolery. Let's tap the bypass button and see what happens. Hmm. I mean, you know what? I could probably dial that in a bit better if I was uh, manually futzing with it. I mean, if I was out in the field or I'm dealing with that, I, it's better than nothing. You get what you pay for, right, kids? Um, that's that's not bad at all. I have a fan blowing directly across. If you're wondering what microphone this is, this is a Golden Age D2. Great mic for the price. Great mic for the price if you pair it with a decent preamp and you understand a little bit about audio and how to EQ it properly. So let's get this fan off. And we'll just put that back to normal. So yeah, there we have it. You will uh, find all that with... Uh, I'll just put everything in the descriptions. I just wanted to uh, take this challenge. This isn't really to show anything. Oh, if you're wondering about system resources, one of the, that's why I said I was curious about why you would need a video card to do this. this mic up really loud um check this out that is the that is a first gen ryzen 7 non-x part that is running a door and let's go ahead and let me reset the noise profile let me give you a completely fair come on don't disappear okay i'm reset the profile and i'm just going to reset it to room noise There we go. And I will enable that. See that? That's got some funkiness to it, doesn't it? Let's try that again. Okay. Now we have that, and I will put my gate on. Let me pull this trim back to something non-existent. And I can bring back in compressor, and we'll bring in the back, bring in the back the de -esser. That's with the entire chain. I mean, it, it's not a hit on a modern CPU, not even in the slightest, not even a little bit. So you can find Noise Repellent. Um, links in the description. Uh, just do a search for Noise Repellent. You will find it. It is there. And, you know, if, if you're on Linux and you want to do this, that's the thing. You, there's more options with this, and you can do it in real time, as we just demonstrated. And routing that, you know, I'm using OBS right now to record this, so it's completely doable. I could do the same thing with Discord using Jack and Pulse Audio. Okay. That's that. Let's go back to the really painful bright shot. Uh, uh, yeah, that's it. I just want to say bye. Everybody. Thanks, everybody, who makes this possible. Patreon.com forward slash Linux Gamecast. We're horrible at doing blogs. Um, go check our stuff out. LinuxGameCast.com. All right. Uh, stay silent. Dynafire.